Haven't you ever heard of knocking? This is urgent. You need to come downstairs right now. What the hell is this? This is your new Kappa Pledge class. I asked for a Kappa Pledge class. Now the cast are freaks and geeks. Get off my couches. Get off my couches. They're infested. We have to burn them. You need to calm down. Maybe we should go into the dining room and talk. None of you move a single cell until we return. Who is that? Damien Price, Kappa President. Really, Kaden? You brought in four mortals? How do you know they're mortals? I told him. Kaden, you've had a lot of dumb ideas in the past, but this is by far the worst one. And especially after our talk yesterday, you decided not to listen. I'm going to prove you both wrong. I'm building this haven back to its hierarchy. How so? You'll see. I'm waiting for a vision. I'm clairvoyant, you know. <laughs> You're clairvoyant? Please tell me when the last time you had a vision was. When you brought Charlie here? <laughs> exactly. You were the furthest from clairvoyant, my friend. I'm still Prime Witch. And you put me in charge. And at the end of the day, I am still more powerful than you. But I am still Prime Witch and I have the final say. Fine then. Draw the line in the sand because we are now a house divided. How do we get rid of them? We'll treat them like the pledges they are. Form yourselves in a single final line and one by one state each of your names and explain to me why you think you have what it takes to be a member of Kappa Sigma, as if I even care. Go! What's your name, Oprah? I suddenly can't read. Tell me your name. She doesn't talk. She can speak for herself. Now tell me your name. <laughs> no name it is. What about you? Theo Kessler. I'm captivated by everything witch related, so I thought I would attend college here in Salem. That's pathetic. Next. Aaliyah Wolf. I heard sorority sisters and brothers are really close. I just want to find some sense of belonging. My apologies. That was the most boring story I've ever heard. Now. Your first assignment as pledges will be to go into the front yard and polish every single stone you can find. Better get started because we're going to get it for a very long time. Have fun! This is a sorority tradition in which the pledges are asked to perform ridiculous tasks with their loyalty to their brothers and sisters. You're a first sister? In your hand, you have one $4,000 first class round trip ticket to Hong Kong. Rip it. What? No. And then get out. Okay, fine. Your task will be to throw a $1,000 Tiffany's necklace into the river. Then leave, bitch. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Well, go ahead. Throw it in. For the past week, I have pushed some of the most intense hazing rituals in Captain history, and somehow you survived. So as much as it ails me to say, congratulations you inbreds, you're officially Kappas. Don't we get a party? I mean, Kappas are known for their bangers. Yes. In honor of your initiation, we will be throwing a white party tonight. What about us? Why can't we come? I knew you were a racist. A white party is thrown by elite societies in which the guests are required to wear white clothing. Oh. I see. So we're just letting them in? I don't get it. I thought the point was so that they don't join. Originally, yes, but plans have changed. So, is there a plan B? There's always a plan B. We wait. Nightmare hasn't attacked in months, so in the meantime, we could just play sorority, and if he decides to attack again, it'll be so scarring for these freshmen that they'll run out of here with their tail between their legs. You're an evil genius. 
It's a blessing and a curse. Now pull out your phone and start tweeting. Cap is throwing a razor. Okay, I'd like to take a second to honor our newest Kappa members. Hell Week may technically be over, but you will all be put to hell every day here. So, if the new brothers and sisters can come over here. Hey. Wait, we're missing Bianca. <laughs> if you'd excuse us for a minute. It's time. Uh, hello, ass munch. We're in the middle of initiating our kappas, and it's gonna require you to be downstairs. Now! <sighs> okay, there is an explanation for this, and... Hold that thought. Excuse me, this is a private party? Who are you? I'm from the witch assassin clan. Out for the takedown of all witches. Well, I'm sorry, there are no witches here. Don't be reticent, Kaden. We know the truth. We can assure you that there are no witches here. We're going to use our powers. <laughs> wow, our own prime lich has obtained powers of telekinesis. Interesting. Okay, so I can only imagine what you're thinking right now, but maybe I can explain things a little bit. We are witches, descendants of Salem. This haven is our home. As you can see, we're kind of under attack by forces of evil. But we're not evil. We're actually very peaceful. We only act violently when we have to defend ourselves in situations like this. I don't know what to say. Well, let me break it down for you. You have two options. Either you stay and help us with our fight against evil, or you leave and never mention a word of this again. This is the most insane thing that's ever happened to me. But it's kind of cool. So I'm staying. Me too. Me too. Get the three elements. We're performing a blood oath. So what exactly happens during these rituals? We present three elements to Hecate, goddess of witchcraft. And once she reveals her presence, the ritual begins. First, we prick each of our fingertips. And then we gather hands. This means you now have supernatural blood running through your system. You swear you're not working with evil forces and your only intentions are to help us? Well, what if we lie? The ritual only happened one time in history, and the person lied. What happened to them? They burned. Once you have supernatural blood in your veins, it prevents you from lying. And if you lie, you burst into flames. Well, I've got nothing to hide, so let's do this. Hecate, goddess of witchcraft. Tonight we gather as we present to you the three elements of life. Earth, water, and fire. Surround us with your darkness as we will now begin our ritual. We share with you our blood in one ring. We ask that you place combustion upon those who are dishonest in our circle. We ask for a swear of honesty from those who are gathered here today. I swear. I swear. Farewell. <laughs> 